Watch, watch. So before you start your CPR, do you feel a bit there? No. You are a ghost. You should feel a bit then. Everybody, you see, we call it, are you listening? We call it a carotid pulse. We call it carotid pulse. Please watch here. Watch again, watch again. Like this. Move it to the angle here. Move it to the angle there. Do you feel it? Okay, so we call it carotid pulse. It's the major artery. Listen, it is the major artery which supply blood to the uh, to the head, to the brain. It's the major artery. So let me give you an example. Those who are doing problem, you have advantage to understand this. You realize that when they are uh, they are doing distribution of water, they have the main, and you know definitely they can't carry the main into your into your house. You can't control the pressure. Do you agree with me? Those doing plumbing, you realize that we have the main. By the time the water will get into your residence, the pressure is what? Reduced so that you can be able to, uh, to control and use it. So we have another pause here, the one my boss told. If someone suddenly collapse, we don't want you to go and check the pause here, but we want you to check the carotid pulse because it is the main. And we say the pulse is when, uh, when the heart pumps blood through the walls of the artery, the rhythm that you feel is the pulse. It is repeating beat when you feel when the heart pumps blood through the walls of the artery. So that is the pulse. So if someone suddenly collapses here and you are able to do your doctor ABC, you check the data, you quickly go well, check the pulse. If the pulse is not there, that is when you start your CPR. Okay?